Well, it's been more than a decade, but they finally did it. Brainerd High School officially worked its way off the state's priority list of struggling schools, and they're not slowing down anytime soon either. News 12's Jordan Simmel spoke with faculty and parents tonight about what's next for the Panthers. He joins us now live in the studio with tonight's top local story. Andrew, good evening. Thank you. Tennessee recently named 13 Hamilton County schools as reward schools and another 13 as level five schools. But for the folks at Brainerd High School, its performance last year has them at a new level of their own. Everyone I spoke with tonight confirmed it. Panther pride, it's alive and well. Priority schools make up the lowest performing 5% of schools throughout the volunteer state. Graduation rates sit below 67%. After more than a decade on that list, Brainerd High has finally made the grade. We recognize we still have tremendous work to do. We still want to get more of our students proficient. We still want to continue to decrease our chronic absenteeism rate. We still know that we have to keep pushing forward and we have to push faster than others because our students are behind. Shayla Hood's son is a senior honor student at Brainerd and she says she's noticed the school's turnaround. After the hard work from teachers, faculty, and students alike, she's proud of Brainerd's changing culture. For future parents, I would just say give Brainerd a shot. I know a lot of times it gets a bad reputation, and I'm always out there defending it, but I think this just proves what we've all been saying. No matter where they fall, what kind of student they are, they will tailor uh, the education to their needs and make sure that their needs are getting met, and they will push them. Not only push them, but I think they'll make them excited about learning. For 20 years, LeVar Brown has seen numerous administrations come and go as the school trended downward, but it never discouraged him to leave. The veteran teacher says it actually motivated him to stay and help his school succeed. When I started there, it was the premier school of the city. When I was a, a high school student there, it was, it was one of the premier schools of the city. So to see it go to the bottom five and to come out and the direction that we're going is truly awesome and it's amazing. What's, what's happening, what's taking place in our building right now. Dr. Sorrells is also an alum of the school and says the new culture being built inside Brainerd's walls are leading them into a bright future. Earlier today, she and I discussed the 26 combined reward and level five Hamilton County schools. She believes if Brainerd keeps trending upward, it's only a matter of time until they're on that list as well. Live from the studio, Jordan Simmel, News 12.